whether it's safe or not to get in his car and drive away. According to Vox, the earthquake reduced thousands of buildings to rubble and left a complete humanitarian disaster behind. Clark International is an airport in the northern Philippines, servicing domestic and international flights. Clark's history dates back to 1919, when the U.S. Army converted the area into an airfield, and that airfield served as an important overseas base during World War II. The Philippine government took control in the early 90s, and Clark International Airport opened in 1996. 23 years later, on April 22nd of 2019, a 6.1 magnitude earthquake rocked Clark International and those inside. Travelers grabbed their loved ones and scattered for cover, but some wound up trapped when debris began falling from the ceiling. A terminal full of eager travelers descends into chaos as the earthquake shakes everything inside, including our CCTV cameras. One man gets stuck on a banister after getting through security. He almost drags the entire line with him. We see another security team panic as they run for cover. Debris and light fixtures fall from the ceiling, narrowly missing two women. At the check-in area, people cover their heads and hope for the best. And at the end of the line, we see a few men barely escape outside before the roof caves in above them. Aftermath shots of check-in and the departure area make one thing pretty clear. A powerful earthquake just tore through Clark International Airport.